Okay, big day. In this box is my new Lingo sensor. I am really excited about this. I've been waiting years for something like this. I've been wanting a CGM for a long time. And since this now it can be available without a prescription, it makes it so much, so much, so much easier. Uh, ordered it Thursday, got it today, and today is Monday which is fast. And I ordered the $250 option, which was, I think, 12 weeks. Uh, anyway, they shipped two. No, I ordered two, shipped two. So I guess there's two in, I think, there's two sensors. Each sensor works, works for two weeks. Eh, anyway, I'll figure that out. What I went ahead and did was download the Lingo app and uh, as I was prepping to make this video, I just went ahead and actually signed up for an account, which I should have done before, but I didn't think you, I thought you needed to have this, the sensor with you. Um, and here it is. Uh, two of them in here. I got the big, the longest plan that you can get because it was the best deal. Uh, again, it's the $250 one. And what was that notification? Okay. So I am went ahead and alcohol wiped my the back of my arm. The from the looks of it should be right about here. Which is good because I want to be able to put things around my arm. <laughs> and before I got this, as I was making the decision, um, I was always kind of freaked out by the idea that there's a filament in the uh, sensor, the CGM sensor. And I was even a little bit, I'm not freaked out by needles, but still I was a little freaked out by the um, illustrations on the Abbott website for their, uh, their, their, their sensor, the sensor number two, Libra sensor two. But what it shows is basically like a thumb deck the sensor and the thumbtack what as i've watched a really good i believe he's german youtuber who is a type 1 diabetic and he showed what it what it actually is the the needle you see in the on the abbott website for their cgm product not the lingo so the lingo is technically a biosensor and this is how they avoid the prescription thing but what it is is that thumbtack is actually a needle that the filament uh, sits in so the needle pierces your arm the back of your arm and it'll just uh, basically allows for a place for the filament to go straight in and then you retract the needle and it keeps the filament kind of sitting in your arm again I, I'm li just listening to Tim Ferriss for years I mean he even mentioned like the first few generations were, were pretty painful <laughs> And, you know, I'm, I'm an active guy and have stuff tight around my arm. I just didn't want anything just to, to get in the way of uh, my training. And that's, again, like, I got to figure out where, where on my arm do I want to have it? Do I want to have it up here? And with my jerseys tend to be, like, right, you know, the, right over the elbow joint. And we'll try it out and see. And the good thing is, is the sensors last two weeks and I'll be able to, if I don't, Hopefully they don't fall off, but if I don't like the where where it feels, I can just start moving around. So anyway, it says on the app, continue, already registered and giveaway, opted out of a lot of sharing my data for now. Uh, select the site on the back of my arm. I don't know if there's any glare. Ooh, nice. And like I said, it should be somewhere right about yours. Okay, I washed it already with uh, alcohol. Didn't do it so. Washed it with alcohol. And peel the lid off the sensor. Kind of looks like a um, <laughs> stack cup for applesauce. So, peel off completely, peel the lid completely off via sensor pack. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, continue. Unscrew cap from 
IO sensor applicator. That's this, and it's telling me to take that off. So yeah, so this is just a plastic cap for this. That looks kind of hardcore. Okay, hit continue. You take this applicator, so there's a line up front, and it's only on one edge. Line it up with the line here. So this goes like such. It says to line up the mark the dark mark on the biosensor pack on a hard surface, press down firmly on the biosensor applicator until it comes to a stop. That's a stop. Lift biosensor and applicator out of... Oh, yeah, okay. So I don't know if you can see this. The needle, there's the needle. Oh out of the pack. The biosensor applicator is ready to apply by uh, biosensor applicator is ready to apply biosensor. Do not touch inside a biosensor applicator and don't show on YouTube. Kidding. Or put it back in the biosensor pack. Okay. Place biosensor applicator over sight and push down firmly to apply biosensor. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, no way, I don't feel anything. <laughs> okay, the only thing is, is you hit continue and watch me do something completely wrong. Gently pull biosensor applicator away from your body. What? <laughs> Make sure biosensor is secure. Didn't feel a thing. I mean, nothing. What I felt was more of like the cup part, just kind of, pushing on you and even then a cup is more uncomfortable than what I felt it was just more like yeah, you know, just the solid pressure you know, say to take the blunt end of the applicator and just kind of like that I mean holy cow that is crazy the ironic thing is I actually kind of decided to go down lower this I had actually originally planned to go a little bit higher but this actually makes sense to go down lower for me my personal application okay Ready to scan. Hold the top of your phone very close to the biosensor. Oop, scanned. And it, that was it? Did it? Okay. Sorry about the glare, but it says, see your current glucose trend and glucose graph at a glance. I th from what I saw on the reviews is it takes about an hour for it to start accumulating enough data to make anything out of it. Okay, so here we go, continue. Click on the icon to see your biosensor information. It will always be in the upper right hand corner of the screen. Red dot means your biosensor has an error. Let's hope we don't have a, a red dot. Click on it to learn more and troubleshoot. Okay, orange dot means your biosensor expires soon, which should be at the end of two weeks. You'll see this three days before your biosensor bio expires. View your biosensor information, including remaining biosensor life, which is pretty cool. I was wondering about that. Current readings and trend. And just out of, um, in case you're curious, this is what the biosensor bottom looks like. So this is what the sensor resided in before you put this on to grab it out. And if you look really close in the center, there's the hole for the needle. Check on errors to keep your experience running smoothly. Access your biosensor manuals. Okay. Let's get started. You're all set. Let's get started. Yeah, here it goes. Your biosensor is getting to know you and you'll start to see, to see readings after 60 minutes. Uh, sorry, I got the ring light lighting me. Uh, I do feel just... I got my shingle shot like four weeks ago on this arm oof that thing hurt that hurt <laughs> uh this does not feel like that it feels 
like it's more of just the weight of the sensor on your arm that you feel it's like a little bit of like a poking a little bit of like a tiny little bit of pressure i can't think of any shot that i've gotten lately that reminds me of what that feels like but again absolutely shocked that i did not feel anything on this and in fact it probably felt more because i was just like jamming in in there on my arm to make sure it got stuck and it's like the, the needle part you did not feel so cool so let's get started welcome to lingo this is where you see your real life real time glucose data once your biosensor is ready and uh there it goes and so and we're off and what's cool thing is is there is a timer on the top and it says 57 minutes 10 seconds before the actual reading goes yeah so this would be really cool can't wait thanks for watching and i will continue to give you updates on this but my goodness absolutely pain pain free i actually thought with a box you'd have to scan a qr code to get the data but it kind of makes sense to not do that and just have it read off the sensor itself that way it cuts down on manufacturing issues of like getting labeling all wrong and whatever right um uh, yeah yeah again you, you get your your snack pack you get your applicator that screws onto here uh so easy amazing 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 so yeah super psyched in 56 minutes i'll get some data i'm gonna go do a workout and have dinner so that's i wanted to make sure i did this before dinner so i can get some start gathering data. So excited, so excited.